All right, so Randy from Happy Meal Nursery here, and uh, today we're going to work with this uh, dwarf Scotch pine. Um, these are um, actually grafted. So you can see there's actually a little stub there from where the graft is, but the union's actually quite clean. So let me see what we can make from this. I'm thinking this would be our best front after studying it for a little bit. What we're going to do is just remove some of the big thick branches. Um, we got rid of some soft fly larvae there that were chomping away at the branch. We're going to thin this out a bit and see what we can keep. So let's get to it. First things first, I think this big back branch has to go. It's just too big, so I think we'll get rid of that. This, clear some of this right here where there's a bit of a knuckle that started. And, uh, and then try to build the top with maybe a long sacrifice leader. And while we're doing this, we're just going to keep our eye out for some soft fly uh, larva. It could be chomping away on some needles. So first things first, we're going to take this right off. So we'll turn that into a gin. I think we'll make this our maybe first branch here. This out here, a little thick. We take this out too. So a branch here, potentially we've got two little branchlets, so we'll maybe reduce this down, keep that for now. Got another one in the back that we can use all kind of coming out of the same place, so not so great, but we'll leave it for now. I don't want to take too much off right now. Basically, we want to also allow some light to penetrate in here, so. This would be a nice little branch. It's quite small. It's got a lot going on, though. Kind of empty through here, which could be a problem. It goes up like this and then over and out, so let's take this out. This we'll have to shorten up. Turn that down. <clears throat> One of these should be the leader. Maybe we'll actually get rid of some of this. Stronger in branches here. Stimulate some back budding. Got a lot going on here. Just take the strong guy out. Couple choices for a leader, maybe one of these. The larva did attack that one. Could be some more in here, so oh yeah, there's a couple right there. So we'll just take those guys out. Move a whole bunch here. Look at them all. Alright, so we're just gonna do the old some finger and rinse that out. That was a lot. Could be some more in here too. Still moving. And birds would be interested. But yeah, they show up pests. So keep an eye out on them. You can see where they've clearly been. We've lost a lot of needle here. You can see that they're starting to cut down some of the needles in here too. On this. So, not a huge deal. That. This would be a nice branch. It's quite small. These are big. We need a back branch, maybe somewhere. All right. 
So we'll gin this. <coughs> Maybe deal with some of the bulk in the back. A little branch back here, but they're all kind of originating from these kind of layers. So we really want that. We want them to go kind of alternating and build our basic structure. Got some nice titan buds here though, so hopefully we can get those to take off. And maybe we'll let, let one of these take off. Maybe take this out. Sinking our leader, we want to come forward with just to give some interest. We could send it back maybe on this, in which case one of these branches would be important, or even use this. So I think that's kind of what we'll leave for now. We'll wire this down. Maybe, maybe this, and that'll be kind of it. We'll just hope to uh, get some back budding. And then we'll wire this up, I think. We'll wire this down and then up. This over here, this over here. You know, there's too much here. They got a knuckle for sure. But uh, that's kind of it. die back a little bit naturally we'll take the bark off now while it's easy yeah we got options which is what this stage is all about let's check if there's any more larvae here it's a pretty tight space you could spot them to hang out it doesn't look like it all right, so that's kind of it. Wire these, this and this down. So we need a fairly decent gauge wire here. We'll actually use our gin here as a bit of an anchor. into the bud. Go back into the bud there. It's probably actually that bud. So we'll wire these two together. So the caterpillars actually were attacking this branch. We're gonna go quite light on it. See if we can get it to bounce back. We might actually have done a bit of our job. bud there and there. Hopefully we'll get them waking up. Poof. Pull a few of these needles down here. So, that's what we have. We're gonna try to make this our main leader. 
I'll let that guy go for now. I'll let this guy go for now. We've got some small branches here we could attempt to use, but they're on the inside of the curb, so not so great. Got maybe a back branch we might need. Might wire this guy down over here. Just to be sure nobody's shading anybody. Just keeps wanting to come up. Pretty bald over here. We're gonna need something over here. Looks super ugly. But our main line is gonna go a bit like that up over. So we'll see what we can do with that. Certainly could go with something else in here, but we'll get that nice taper. We just gotta let this thing grow. Pines are slow. So we'll feed it well, water it well. And that's that for now. Lots of work to go. Maybe even field plant this guy for a bit. Let's try to bulk it up. That's it. Take you on a little tour here. So just going up our main line, we'll go up. Maybe first branch out there, second branch here. A third branch up here over here hopefully we can build something in this area or we can pull something down visually um, or from the top out here then we have some sacrifice leaders which will keep growing and some branches that will come off um, just to avoid this burl here and there's another burl down here we got a neat little line and that's how we'll leave it all right mm -hmm.